welcome to the channel. Back inside the cabin. That's right. Feels like I've been stuck in here for a month. Well, I kind of have, doing all the work that I've been doing. And today, I'm going to do something really fun. I'm going to start putting more of my floor on. You can see right here where Miss Rooster is. I've got about, I don't know, eight rows down. Yeah, it was not fun. Almost half the living room. Uh, so we're going to get back down here today. i got to move all this stuff back out. Actually, I'm going to move my recliner in that chair. And then, you know, I'm just shuffling it around is what I'm doing. I'm vacuuming, putting the floor down. Vacuuming some more, putting the floor down. It's pretty cold out there, Rooster. I don't think you want to go out. So we're going to get this down. I think it's going to be really nice. But, man, oh, i got to pull this row up and fix that. I'm dealing with some bad pieces in these boxes, you know. There's a reason you get it cheap at Ollie's, and that's why. There's some damaged pieces you got to swap out. Uh, it's been a while since I put a floor down, so I got to get back into the swing of things. So I'm not going to spend a lot of time here talking. Uh, I'm kind of holding off on the cabinets. Let me show you what I did. Yeah, tore that cabinet out. So we're just going to have one long cabinet here with the butcher block on it. I will put my drawers back in that. I uh, took the tracks off the old one. It's just a lot easier and then I, I can do some more work in here and make this look a little better than what it is. And as far, as far as another outlet, I don't know why I never thought of it, but I got juice right here, man. I just get another piece of wire, come down, have me another outlet up here if I want it, which I think I want it. So that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to get busy. Probably not going to film me doing much of this flooring because it is a very, very slow process. <laughs> I'm lucky. It should go a lot quicker once I get past the stairs here because it's half the distance. Uh, three pieces, so it should go pretty quick. I am hoping to get in here and get this done. I'm hoping to get all the way to here today. We'll see where we get. I don't know. I, this is the second day of doing the floor, and I'm pretty sore. So I'm just going to have to work through that, doing some stretching. So I'm going to put on some loose-fitting sweatpants and get busy. Now I am not going to. I am not going to floor inside under the stairs. I am going to be building a cabinet here, so none of that will be seen uh, for storage. Same as up in there, and. I'm only going to be able to floor to about where that safe is because I can't obviously pick that up. So we'll deal with that later. But I will say have pieces extra for when I do get that moved. That we can get it in place. So I'm not going to spend a lot of time yapping. Let's get working. Alrighty. Now I'm starting on this part where I can't use the same length pieces that I had. So I'm taking some of that cutoffs that I had but I'm keeping with the line that I already had where I'm staggering these I got this big old piece of styrofoam for and this is going pretty easy now get out of there hammer ah. I, every time I go out I drag in something the grass I don't know alright just kind of jiggle and wiggle. Now, if your finger stops, if, if, if you can feel a ridge or something when you're uh, doing it, then it ain't in good. This is the only part I have trouble with. Okay, there we go. Little pieces are generally simple. There we go. You don't have to tap it in too often, really. This piece. Get in there. <clears throat> oh, yeah, that's good. That's good. Give it one more tap. All right. Now, I've got to cut another piece, and i got 
this is awful. I don't know why I cut that like that. Why didn't I go at an angle? It's too late now. I just have to go with it. I think when I put something on the face of that stairs, I'll just come around. I'll, I'll come up with something. I've learned to be pretty good at covering up my mistakes. You have to be. Come here, you. All right, so. That's going to be silly. I wonder if it'll slip under that. Then I won't have to cut squat. No, but I can cut that to where it will. Then I don't have to notch around this. I'll get my uh, oscillating tool and cut that. It's easier than trying to figure out how to notch it around there. All right, where's my... Uh, I don't know where's what. Oh, and I kind of stopped over there. I'll come back to that later. Uh, we'll just see what we get to do. All right, my oscillating tool. All these tools are just in here somewhere. I had that yesterday. Uh, those plants, oh my God, I gotta get those things fixed, uh, repotted. There it is. Ah, sorry for the moon. This tool is worth its weight in gold, man. Oh, I can't believe I did that. All right, we just need a little bit off of it. What's with all the theatrics, man? It's a thick board. Look, man, don't die on me now. Come on. All right. I'll come back in a bit. Obviously, as soon as you hit record, all that business starts happening. I don't know what it's about. All right. Very, very, very slow progress. I ended up having to pull off about three rows. Because one back where that water bottle was, was out of the, uh, it was out of the groove. And then I looked in that corner and I seen it was all the way up against the wall. So it wasn't square. Oh God, there's another one that's up. This is so aggravating. I, you know, I've done this before. I did it in the office and that was used. My brother had already laid it, gave it to me and it went down easier than this stuff. So I don't know if it's the brand. I don't know if it's just being down there hurts. And you're trying to hurry? I don't know. But this man, this stuff ain't going together like that did. And I am not liking the results, but uh, I'm pretty picky. But, man, uh, we're just going to keep going. That's all I can do. I already got the stuff. All right, man. Anything interesting happens, I'll come back. But it's frustrating. You just slide up in there, nice and easy. Uh -huh. Well, there you go, there you go. All right. Corn dogs and bubble gum, corn dogs and bubble gum. I like corn dogs and bubble gum, bubble gum. <laughs> I just wrote that. That's gonna be a smash hit. What's going on? Why are you way up in the air? Get in there. 
Oh man, okay, that's a good seam right there if we can maintain it. Jiggle wiggle, wobble and wobble. Why ain't you going right here? That would be the issue. See, you get one every now and then, it just fights you. It hates you, and it fights you. Now you won't come out? You're gonna knock the other one out? Ah, man. Don't do it. Have I got it in the right way? I do. So what's the problem? There you go. Ah, now that one pops out. Back in. Okay. There we go. Uh, I knew. I just knew. If I hit record, this one would give me hell. All right. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take you out. And I'm gonna do this. You're good. Alright, you're gonna go in smoothly now. Very smooth. With no troubles. Uh huh. Uh huh. Ah. Did you go? But you're not down that way. Now you are. Little, little more. Senor. A little more senor. There you go. Now, jiggle wiggle. Lock in place. What is the malfunction? There it goes. Oh, this stuff is so fragile. Thank you. Four. I'm wondering if the cold floor has anything to do with it. All right, I gotta get you in or I gotta stand up and stretch because I can't be down here much more. You understand me? All right, that part's in nice. Well, the whole thing's in. How'd that happen? No seam? Hey, man. It listened to me. What about this end? Ow! It's got my skin. See, I get this end in, and then this end pops out. And it shouldn't be because there's no seam here. Well, there is a seam in there. All right, let's try this. Put your palm down there. There it went. All right. A little more. Sometimes you just gotta whack the Hades out of it. The whole thing's in, except for the end. Oh, there it goes. Now, bop it on the end and you're good. Now, then it came out there. Oh, this has been the whole morning. Okay. I'll be here all month, I swear. All month. I gotta cut a piece. I really shouldn't even cut it because it's going in there and it's gonna have a floor. Yeah, I'm just not even gonna cut it. Put the whole piece in there. Why have another strap, huh? Why? All right, that last row went on went on without a hitch. Uh, I think a lot of the problem is this sunlight that's coming in is really highlighting where these seams are because I'll go down there and look. I mean, they're down. They're down, the edges are down. So it's just kind of, because I, I noticed last night, I mean, I did not notice seams. So, you know, maybe I'll shut the curtains. I don't know. All right, now I got to move all this crap in here. Uh, what is this? See, the sunlight's, yeah, that's down. It just fools you. That could actually be pounded in a little more. But I noticed the floor. I don't know if, the, if it's the foundation or what. It's kind of low in this end, end here nice and flat here but down there it's uh nice and fine 
why aren't these kids, I thought these kids went back to school this week. I guess not. Man, we only got like five days for spring break. Whatever. All right, so let me get this stuff moved, and hopefully once I get past that point, it goes pretty quick. I'm having to cut these, and I'm getting a lot of scrap, so I, my pattern could not stay the same. I had to change my pattern up because, you know, how it is. So hopefully we get into that open area and we can get back to that. I don't care at this point. I just want to get this done. living room is done we are ready to head into the office get this part of the hallway done hopefully i can get at least to that wall today that way i can start moving some stuff into this office because uh we gotta get this place organized man crazy so that went pretty good this ought to be pretty quick got a few little cuts in here no big deal uh, I got 13 boxes left, so more than enough. Should be more than enough to do the whole thing. Uh, I've used, what, seven? So, yeah, we should have plenty. All right, man. All right. So, we got a little order now to the chaos. I'm going to start off here in the morning. I ain't going to overdo it today. And, uh, man, I don't, I don't see no reason why we don't make it to the kitchen tomorrow. We got everything put back in here, got the rug put back down, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be happy when this part's done. Uh, I only put those base boards in with a couple of screws, so I'll be pulling those off before I put the floor, that, and you can see I left the gap, uh, or, so like I can put those back up where they need to be, and then they'll be a nice tight fit. So This is probably a real short video. Because they're just it's it's hard to film something like this because I'm I I can't do a time lapse it takes me too long but well we got the living room part done and like I said I'm not doing under the stairs I got to cut that piece off and I got to do this piece here but I'm gonna leave this off for now so I can get that safe moved if you can see there's temporary legs under there those aren't meant to be on there all the time so. I've got an appliance dolly. I get some help. We tip that back, get them legs off, and then move it into the pantry. So for now, I mean, that's that's a half hour's worth of work there to fix that. Yeah. And then I got to do dishes, man. Whatever. I love that new induction stovetop. I've been using it. I got my new, well, they're dirty. Let me find. I got some clean ones. My new pots and pans are pretty cool looking. Yeah, they'll work on there. Cast iron. I've been using the cast iron. That works too. I'm fixing to make me some sloppy mics. Manwich. So that's going to be over here. Uh, man, I hope I'm done with all this crap in a few weeks because it's getting old. I got other things. I got to get that garden going. But we've got like 30 degrees tonight. You know, it's that time of year. We've had our last freeze like as late as April 20th. So last year I planted early and got lucky. I don't think I'd do that this year. Just got a feeling it's gonna be a late freeze. Don't know, but we've had days in the mid 80s too. So, yeah, let me see where them dogs are. Well, here's one. Yeah, I don't blame me for being inside. It's kind of cold out today and windy, huh, boy? You ain't got no stories to tell, to tell today? He doesn't. All right, I'm going to go cook my supper. You guys had your supper and you had your chew sticks. Yeah? Did you lose your voice? You're trying to say something, but, you know, nothing's coming out. What about you, Lily? I got a peeping tom. That's not a peeping tom. That's a that's a peeping Tilly. They're like a peeping tom, only they're much shorter and they got big long ears. I know. Big long ears. And waggedy tails. And to clear one thing up, guys, I know on camera for some reason this looks yellow. That is yellow. Look at there, lemon juice, mustard. Yellow as you get. There is nothing more yellow 
then lemon juice and mustard. So the walls don't look so yellow now, do they? It's a beige. Pretty much the same color as the outside of the cabin. Not yeller. Thanks for watching. Happy trails. Mm. Ooh, let's chase. Let's chase that. Mm. Happy trails.